Slappy Friday, everybody. It's your tennis coach, Old Cappy here. And yeah, I used to play tennis, but I'm probably not qualified to be your coach. But that doesn't matter because we got another C4 energy drink here today. And you might be saying, oh, yo, Chaz, why is this like weird looking? Why does it look different from the other two you did? And that's because it is slightly. This is um, part of C4's Super Brain line. What is Super Brain? I'm not quite sure. I kind of looked at it. Uh, the other one's called Superhuman, so that one's for like body and mind. I'm guessing this one is just for mind. I could use a little mind wake up. I just woke up about, I don't know, 40 minutes ago. <laughs> and I'm still not, it's probably less than that. Um, so this one's called Electric Sour. That's pretty cool. I'm kind of interested in what flavor this is. It's got a neat gradient. It goes from dark green to light green, or light green to dark green, however you look at it. Can's a bit different, because the superhuman one is pretty generic looking for all of them. Maybe not generic, more homogenous, I suppose that's the word. Because it's like a yellow with the black lines, and then the only difference in color is going to be around the top. This one... All of these super brain ones actually use a different color scheme because I got another one coming out later. Uh, this was given to me by front of the channel Kyle because I traded him a beer and two one shots of G Fuel. Spoiler alert, there's going to be another bit of G Fuel videos coming out. I haven't done the first round, but there's actually more coming because I ordered some more and I might even order e even more. <laughs> <laughs> down the line. Anyway, smart energy. Is it smart? Could be. I mean, G Fuel's been pretty good, but I'm kind of nervous a little bit about how this one's going to taste because it's not the superhuman line. What are they going to do differently? Are they going to use different uh, enzymes and amino acids and stuff? Because that could alter the taste. It could. It could very well alter the taste of the uh, super brain line. But... It's looking, it looks about the same. This is kind of new, I think. I don't remember seeing Innova tea. What the heck is that? Made from green tea leaves, fermented green tea leaves. So is this going to make me <laughs> buzzed? <laughs> uh, this naturally derived caffeine delivers anytime. So these are probably like more tea flavored. Maybe we'll see. We'll have to see. Um, break the rules, change the game, and outsmart the competition. Tap into the limitless power of your mind. Unleash your inner Einstein. Oh, my inner Einstein. I was hoping I'd be more like Charles Xavier and, like, able to, you know, stop time and stuff. If I drink this, I mean, maybe this is what Charles Xavier was drinking. <laughs> Recommended for 18 and over. So that's the unofficial warning. The official warning is going to be by the ingredients. Cognizine. This patented citrulline is designed to support mental focus, attention, and recall. Um, Friday is not really a day I care about mental focus. It's a very easy day at work. It's a very easy laid-back day. But, you know, whatever they want. I mean... The superhuman one helps your body more so, and this one helps your mind more so, so I don't know. I think it's all just hoopla, probably. It's just to sell more things. Oh, you want to you wanna do well on your test, Bobby? Um, well, drink the super brain C4. <laughs> maybe, you'll, maybe you'll get all the questions right. All right, let's take a look at the ingredients and stuff. And this, they were selling this at a gym, which makes no sense. Like, why would you sell the super brain one over the superhuman one at the gym? I don't know. Uh, you know, counting your reps is real hard. <laughs> All right, we got zero calories. Uh, serving size is one can. I apologize. I got to do that first. Uh, zero calories, zero grams total fat. Zero milligrams of sodium, zero total carbs, zero sugar, zero added sugar, and zero grams of protein. And then we got 190% of niacin and 
vitamin B12, we got 250%. So I think, you know, I gotta, I gotta relook at the video, but I think that might be a bit lower than the superhuman one, I think. Th that's just me guessing. It just feels like it's lower. And then we got ingredients. And there's like less in this, too. There's way less in this. Yeah, there's definitely, this is definitely um, like a watered down version, I guess. Kind of like the Monster M100 or M500 or whatever. I covered that in a text blog, which I guess I can link in the description, but you probably won't read it. <laughs> Ingredients. Carbonated water, malic acid, natural flavors, tauric acid, citric acid, coenzyme citrulline, um, potassium benzoate, ino, inova, inova tea, that's what it's called, inova tea, green tea leaf extract, sucralose, acylphane potassium, niacinamide, uh, and pterodactyl L-tyrosine, there's that, that's their like, that's their energy thing. C4 likes using that n pterodactyl thing. <laughs> and cyanocobalamin. So there's not even... Um, there's not even pyridoxine hydrochloride in this. There's not... What else is it? There's not inostal. There's not taurine. This is... This is pretty bare bones in terms of other energy drinks. What's the ca was there even caffeine in this? There's natural caffeine from the uh, green tea extract. I don't know, man. This just seems really low key. So I mean, if you're worried about all that kind of stuff, maybe you want to consider the super brain if it works. I don't know. Let's pour this thing. Keep out of reach of children. Store in a cool, dry place. Where's the uh, warning? Maybe that was the warning, like, keep out of reach of children. It doesn't say, huh. Oh, sweet, look at this on the side. This is something I didn't know. They, These are things that they actually borrowed from other people. The Innova tea, which is of Nutra science. Isn't that, like, that stuff that people use to keep fit, Nutra something? And then they, it's like a scam? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Cug... Well, that's like an umlaut over the Z there. It's, but it's like, I guess that's Korean. Kawaba Hako Biocore. I don't know. It doesn't say where it's from. So, yeah, I mean, there's no warning on this. So, is this even an energy drink? I mean, it says don't drink if you're 18, but that's not official. That's just the company saying that. It's not, there's no government warning or anything. 200 milligrams of caffeine. Okay, that's what, that's... All right, let's pour this. Let's, let's, let's drink this. Let's see if this tastes good. Hold on. I had to really deep dive in this. I thought, I did not know this was going to be as extensive as it was going to be. So, electric sour, that means it's part of the uh, Dr. Teeth and the electric band, right? Mm, interesting. It doesn't smell that nice from over here, to be honest. Um, up close, when I bring it up to my nose, it smells sort of like green apple, sort of. I mean, it's very weak. Let me smell again. There's also kind of a herbal scent to it, which is weird. Like, because I, when you smell an energy drink, you're not thinking herbal, unless it's that Jocko stuff. Let's have a sip. It tastes weird. I definitely get like a little sour zing to it. It's not overly sour. It's sour in the sense of like starbursts, which aren't all that sour unless you get the extra sour version. But this is like base starburst sour.
fizzy water taste into semi-sweet kind of taste into sour but like a punch of herbal like a little punch like 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 uh like that i guess i can kind of taste green tea extract so it's kind of like a sweet green tea soda sort of taste to it and then like in the end part of the flavor it's sort of sour into the aftertaste which is also sort of sour and sort of sucralosey. I don't know. It's not that good, to be honest, and that's kind of disappointing because C4 has had some pretty quality products. Um, yeah, I'm not a fan of it. Yeah, this is, and then after the aftertaste is green tea taste, so I don't know. If you like green tea, maybe you'd care for this, but I think the Super Brain is... Um, not really the line you want to go for with C4. It's a shame, too, because the uh, superhuman ones are delicious, in my opinion. But this this one's not that great. Weak flavor and kind of... I kind of know I'm drinking something that's energy drink-like, I guess. It's not overly medicine-like, but it's not great. That's all I gotta say. I mean, the sour fl- taste tastes kind of manufactured that's about it